A major trigger warning, 15 minutes of torture, and in the end, a Connecticut woman facing charges for killing her dog. She told the cops she snapped when the dog attacked her child, meaning a small scratch on the one-year-old's nose that had already begun to scab over. 31-year-old Naisha Squigglia in court after getting caught on a neighbor's security camera video beating, kicking, whipping, slamming, dragging, and swinging the young female pit bull by the neck, continuing to attack the dog, police say, slamming it to the ground even when the dog appeared lifeless. The pup never showed any type of aggression during those 15 minutes of terror, torture, violence, and pain before she died. Cops found the dog covered in dirt and sand, the dog's head twisted backward with its chin pressed along the spine. We are not showing any of the graphic videos, though we did find Squiggly on TikTok. Now keep in mind, she's been in trouble with the law before, larceny, forgery charges, and this time violating her, her probation. In this case, at first charged with cruelty to animals, and then that charge upgraded to malicious wounding or killing an animal. First, she denied it, but when cops showed her the videos, that's when she confessed and said she, quote, had to kill it. Police took the one-year-old to his father and then filed a report for child abuse and neglect. The day before this, another video showing Squigglia, her one-year-old son and dog on the front porch, the dog wagging its tail, Squigglia seen petting it, and the dog doesn't show any signs of aggression. Now, Squigglia will go before a judge of the Bridgeport, Connecticut Superior Court. That's January 29th. Meantime, if you want your voice heard, you can always get in touch with State Attorney Joseph Corradino's office, the number 203-696-3000, or email connDCJ at ct.gov. All that information, if you missed it, is in the link in my bio.